not trying to sue me. Well, that's a very big, busy day. Okay, but um, we will cover what people wanted to, to know. I will be very short today. My name is Mr. T. Uh, this is Wanda Dion Scotty. Uh, guys, basically, Aban uh, Bafuna was the Ubana. Okay, right. Uh, Mr. T, the Fumene was so good. The Fumene called. Go down, get a setting. Go, 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 that can kill your career, that can destroy you from who you want to be. What may be that, Mr. T? Uh, we are talking about fear. Fear, in the end of when you do a career, you are born day by day. Love, fear. Fear is the fright, but then the fear of failure is the fear that I'm talking about. Okay, so I think, let's push it to the last. Let me give you a few ingredients. Um, let's say three or four of the ingredients that they can make you deal with a stage fright. Then we go dead of fear. Okay, all right. Number one, what makes us, uh, you to be nervous? What makes you to be nervous? When you get on stage, when you get to public space, public performance, when you get on camera, when you get wherever you're supposed to perform. One, it is familiarity. Two, preparedness. Three, assurance or verification. So those are the only things that I will talk about. And if you deal with those, believe me, you will do very well and you will overcome the stage fright. Okay, all right, let's start here. Uh, what is familiarity that I'm talking about? When you're having a gig, familiarize yourself with what work you will be doing, who you will be working with. If I'm going to go figure certain group people, talk to people, talk to other artists. Remember, yesterday we spoke about uh, you bumping into an actor that you might happen to be sharing. The stage with, if you are early in, 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 your, in, in, your, in, in your call. So be early, familiarize yourself with the people that you'll be working with. Who's the director? Oh, okay, Google him. If he's available, Google. When you get there on set, get to see people that you'll be talking to. You. Oh, that's that guy, okay, all right, oh, okay. Then that alone is what you see the name. Okay, it's reducing a lot of pressure on you because now you'll be dealing with people that at least you have seen with the naked eye. Okay, proceeding. Let's go now to, to preparedness. Preparedness. The more you get prepared is the more you reduce your name. Lendo Itatinjenga say class in when you're about to write an exam. When you're going to write examination, if you are unprepared, you didn't study very well, you know the, the minute the examiner comes with the question papers, you will hear the heartbeat. Do -do. Do -do. You are unprepared. You are unprepared. You are unprepared. Yes, it reminds you. Okay? But if you are well prepared, then you won't have those kind of fears, that kind of uh, uncertainty. You know? You, you'll be glad when the examiner comes, you know very well that, you know what, I've studied very well. I wish I can have this paper in my hand so I can write. You get what I mean? And when you receive the paper, you look at question one, question two, mm -hmm. when is he saying, start writing? It's because of preparedness. You can't wait to move on. Grab your marks. Okay, you are sure because you are prepared. Okay, let's move into uh, our film language. 
What is preparedness regarding an actor going to say it? If you have studied the script very well, you have made a research about your character, you now know what the director wants and expect out of you. Then you have already nailed it. You have minimized a lot of pressure, believe me. Let's go again now to assurance. In the assurance, it is when you have performed for your family, but now you have gone maybe to rehearsals as well. You have managed to listen to director's instructions. And then you have asked the director, director, can I portray this this way or this way? It's like you are asking a uh, Puma Noma, that is your line. So here you don't understand that Puma Noma is a Puma Noma that is out of anger and emphasis, or it's a light Puma Noma of a first warning when you want to say, please leave me. No, please leave me. Please leave me. Those are three different things. So we have to ask and get the correct one from the director. So that helps a lot. Now, if you have done that, you are sure, you have verified now what is what that is needed. Let's go to fear. I'm sure you're clean about the, the three elements that I just gave you. Okay, fear. Look at fear. Fear is just four alphabets. The first one, that's F. The second one, the third one, the fourth one, yes, F-E-A-R. That is false evidence appearing real. That is fear. That's a guy. It's fear. Take it that symbol. One is to the pyre, so I'm Tiwa and I'm not done. Counting along two chunks is a right human. Hey, I don't know, my lay of the law, but I don't just call it. Hey, I do. I'm not saying you're asking. Okay, what is that? That is a tree. It's never human. But in your mind, you think that is mankind, or that is zombie, or whatsoever. It is something that is false. That's the first F of fear. It is false. Now it is becoming evident because now you are having an imagination of it moving in your mind. That is the E. Now, this false evidence starts to appear. Now, even in your eye, your human body starts to feel. You feel your hair standing. You, yes, yes, it's coming. Yeah. No, there's, there's nothing like that. And then, what will happen now? That R, if this becomes real, it becomes real to you, to your brain, to your emotion, to your feeling. It disturbs you. It will make you be uncomfortable. It is caging you. That is why most of Jesus Christ's statement will, will be saying, fear not, fear not, fear not, fear not. For I am with you all the days till the end of time. Why is he keep on saying that? It's because he knows this is a very harmful cage. It can make your talent go down. It can kill you, destroy you. I think that is it for today based on a uh, fear of the stage, stage fright, as people have mentioned. So don't worry, fear not. <laughs> as long as you are prepared, as long as... Um, you are familiar with what you want to do, and then as long as you also have verified what you want to do, you are sure, make the assurance of this is what I want, this is how I want to do it, and then this is how it has been approved for me to do it. Thank you very much. That is it from me. Uh, catch you next time. Uh, this time around, I don't know what is next. Uh, allow me to get from, the, from you guys. Let, let me get it from you guys. This is still the, the, the act one. We are still on our uh, acting phase one. So we are in the intro. Sisangele staging. Okay? So Sisa Susa Inyoni, Smele staging. Sisa Zungena Gingu set language. Okay? But Maskasi Vibuni, how ready are you for us to move on?
Thank you very much. Uh, don't forget to subscribe on our page, on ASM Film Production page, on YouTube, uh, Facebook, African Star Management. Thank you very much. God bless you.